Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Joey Biagas and I'm an audio engineer and a musician of a few years now. And today I'm going to show you how to import a tempo map into Logic Pro. Okay, it's a pretty, pretty simple and easy process, so let's hop right into it. Now I have Logic Pro open already here, but that's not what we want to do here first. So um, let's say you want to import a tempo map from a MIDI file. We can easily do that, but you don't want to do is you don't want to copy and paste a MIDI file into your already opened uh, Logic Pro session because what Logic does is from that point, it ignores the tempo map um, that is ingrained in the MIDI file and it will just import the MIDI information without any tempo and we want the tempo. So what we have to do is open a brand new Logic session through the MIDI file and that way it'll pick up the tempo map okay so if we take a look at a or at the bottom here we have 120 for the the tempo right here because that's the default setting but let's go ahead cruise up to the top file and go to open okay and then uh, we can just hit close for now um, I won't hit save okay now basically you want to open up the MIDI file that you want uh, that has your tempo map stored. And for my case, I'm going to use this MIDI piano MIDI file. Okay, and then I'm gonna cruise down to open. Boom, all right. And then it's going to ask you to create a new environment or copy current environment for, for MIDI file. And what we want to do is copy the current environment that the MIDI file has, okay, it's a copy. Just wait for it to load for a second. It'll do its thing. Boom, awesome. So we have the, our MIDI information, but what's more important here is down at the bottom, 120. Our tempo, our new tempo that we didn't have to set because it took it um, from the import. All right guys, so that's basically it on how to import the tempo map into Logic Pro. If you do have any other questions, please let us know and thank you for watching.